to a new episode of Sean Resolute. Today we are looking at Wingman Small Energy. I've never seen this brand before. Uh, I got it from Thriftway, which is an expensive supermarket here in Seattle. Uh, is it a Washington thing or Seattle thing? They have them here in Washington anyway. So Wingman Smart Energy, I had to do a little bit of research on this because I have no idea about the company or anything like that. Um, but their big thing, heart, body and mind, which is across there, um, and nit nitric oxide. That seems to be the big sort of selling point, which is in, in your body anyway, and it's to help sort of bring that back um, out. So it says it here, increase your exercise capacity and boost your nitric oxide levels. So that is what this is claiming. Uh, 300 mg of L-arginine, however you pronounce it, 3000 mg of citrulline, and 2000 mg of taurine. Uh, caffeine in this is 160 mg and then 250 mg of ribose, 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 uh, which is powers up AT, ATP production for energy at the cellular level. So that's a lot of stuff, isn't it, Molly? Yeah, Molly's just down here. Um, vegan, non-GMO, gluten-free, and low glycemic. Uh, Where's it made? Let's see. Okay, so that is that's about it. I'll put all the information, nutrition nu information down down below. Um, yeah, and let's taste test it. Flavor is unicorn, isn't it, Molly? Emily's in there. Emily's gonna taste it in a minute. I can stay with this before. Molly? Smelly Not really. Aww, she's very nice. Molly? Oh okay. Oh, we're spinning, we're spinning, we're spinning, we're spinning, we're spinning, we're spinning. Okay, there we go. Taste test. And then we'll get Emily to taste test it in just a second. Um, we're gonna go, we've got CrossFit workout, 6.30, it's coming up to six o'clock now. Um, yeah, farmers carry, toes to bar, thrusters, and some running. Okay, here we go. Cornelius, what are you doing? No. Okay, here we go. Unicorn flavor, that natural flavor that occurs in the world. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh dear. Um, okay, so positives. <laughs> oh, no. It's not like that green one I had that time that I couldn't drink. I can definitely drink it. I am not sure what's going on there. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, let's get it. I think you're gonna like it. Me? No, I'm gonna hate it. Kinda, it tastes like some kind of like icy pop thing, but I don't know what, like an otter pop or... Like a um, blue one. Yeah. You know, I don't hate it as much as a lot of them. Oh my god. And I think it's because it's like kind of sour, which I kind of don't Oh yeah, mind. it is sour. I don't like sour. And it's got it's got stevia and monk fruit, which aren't my favorite, but it doesn't have like that really bad aftertaste of the fake sugar that I hate. I think it is monk fruit. That might be the thing that I'm I think though I think that's what the Jocko one has. Oh. Like I still wouldn't drink it, but I actually like don't hate it as much. Well, it's full. I but think it's designed for people like you. Seattle. Oh, oh my god. Who can stay with this? It's just so 
sitting so daintily on the ottoman. Molly, what are you doing? <laughs> Trying to do a video. <laughs> oh dear. That's so funny that I don't hate it. Yeah, that is. Like, I don't love it. I wouldn't like drink it. But. Okay, so there it is. Emily surprisingly didn't mind this. Um, I drink it. It's in the size of the can that I like. Um, and I don't know, maybe it's because I'm used to the super sort of fake ones but it tastes b bizarre i think it's the it, i don't know yeah because the jackal like yeah i don't i don't know what it is there seems to be something i'm trying to see is it like the flavor that you don't like maybe not so much like ingredient yeah it's like the i don't know Yeah, it might be the sour that I don't like. Mm. But, you know what? I'll drink it. Um, so, yeah. Uh, there's another flavour of them that I saw today. So I might get the other one and review that. If you have tried this one or seen this one, let me know. And let me know what you think. Um, yeah, I'm just a bit confused about it uh, at the moment. But... I'll do the workout, see if it works, and then on the next video, when I review the Wingman one, I'll let you know how I sort of felt with it. But yeah, Wingman Spa Energy. All right, thanks for watching. If you could like, subscribe, much appreciated, and I will be back soon. Bye-bye.